Good morning everyone, this is Unalia, and I have just awoken from, uh, sleep. Um, <laughs> uh, I think I was gonna be leaving, um, today? Yesterday? Something like that? How many days have passed right now? Day 59. How is it day 59 already? Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's so cool! You got other things on the right side. Targeted fluid, Minecraft empty, waterlogged, false, type single, facing north, Minecraft chest. Okay, I need to go... Facing... No, oh, that's north. Okay, so I need to go south. I need to go back that way. But for right now, since I'm all alone... I will sleep in the bed. And I am apparently like sliding. Holy, that is a slippery bed. Oh my gosh. Okay. Very slippery bed. Okay, gotcha. <gasps> oh, I just realized if I sleep the the the, the things don't come. I'm happy. <laughs> I have been dreading the phantom. I have really been dreading the phantoms. Um, I don't want to deal with the phantoms. I am not ready to deal with the phantoms. <laughs> In any shape or form, I'm not. Wow, look at that. Okay, so 1.13 generation is a lot like... Oh, by the way, I took off that sound pack. I didn't... I didn't like it. So, um, the 1.13 generation to me reminds me of the beta generation. And I think a lot of people liked the beta generation of Minecraft. So, I, um, this is just, just a guess. So don't bite my head off. Uh, I think they brought a little bit of the generation back, you know, to make the, the landscape unique. Because some people are like, oh yeah, this is, you know, they implemented it because we liked it. Yay, they're listening. I think it's just, just that. <laughs> I don't think it's because of us. I, I, I don't know. Maybe it is because of us. Maybe they're doing that because of us. I don't know. But, whatever. Um, we're going to take our boat. And I'm gonna sail, sail. I'm going to row, to row, row, row over that way. We're going south for the winter. No, no joke. This is like south for the winter adventure because summer is ending. Actually, we have one more month of summer in August, and then oh, someone's already been here. Uh, and then, um, we're, we're heading to winter. Why, why am I doing this wrong? Because <laughs> apparently I've been playing Star Stable a lot. <laughs> and I shouldn't be. Dang it! Is the auto jump on or something? <laughs> Hang on. Okay, no, everything is, is just me. It's just me. I, I don't understand what is going on with me. I can't play a game. Oh, God. Okay, didn't I just... come from here? Yeah, bun bun. Okay. I did just come from here! I swear to God, I did. I swear to God, I did. Okay, so... Anyways, uh, so let me find something to talk about. I just had a really bad dream. And I don't know if I want to talk about it or not. It's just that bad. It was a really bad nightmare. Uh, it had, it dealt with family and 
so one of my family like causing the elderly to die um like terrorizing them and it and it straight up just got to the point where he and his friends were shooting and it it made me wonder like was this person capable of doing the things that I dreamt of like if so my family is is just gone <laughs> like in the dream all these things were happening and the ones that I had around me I was trying to keep alive and um hang on guys let me let me shut my door so my dog will calm down like I was really working hard to save my family from the shooting and all this this stuff over over money it was it was just over money and it got to the point where I I almost said if this is about to happen if this is still happening I'm gonna have to end him myself like to that point and I I couldn't like there's a there's a feeling in you of like oh it's family you can't do this to family but then natural like I don't know just you don't want to die and you your body's like <sniffs> oh my goodness my nose it just kicks into the protection and the survival mode and it's like come on we got to do this it was like that I was fighting myself trying to get help for my family member to stop doing what they were doing and just try to get them you know to get someone to help them and I am really glad I am so glad now that it was a dream because I was terrified in my sleep I couldn't even get proper sleep. Oh, someone's living here. Wow. Okay. And um it just it just sucked. Am I still going south? Okay, good. Somehow I got turned around from going south and I was going north, so hmm. Anyways. But uh in this in the dream it oh wait didn't didn't she say something uh in the dream it i wasn't sure of uh, whether i should be doing the things that i was doing because i didn't want to get killed off either uh basically my family member was so stressed to the point of getting rid of just everyone everything every just anyone he didn't want anyone around him he was tired of his family telling him lies and he just got tired of it and he was like I'm done y'all y'all can't tell me no anymore um we're done. This is it. I'm getting my friends and y'all are just getting messed up now. So thought of just flesh, really? Boat of just flesh. Who's just flesh? Oh, huh? Um.
So yeah, that 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 was my dream. I I I can't go into too many things about it because it's just that bad. Um like I I'm still kind of confused about reality right now. I do. Um and It's, oh gosh, I'm in a hole. It was really scary, I will say that. I worked my butt off just trying to survive this warped dream morality thing. And it, it just really messed with my head. And that's what, that's what our heads hide. That's what our heads do. That's what our minds do. They mess with us. And it it's almost like they torture us for a reason. And it sucks. <laughs> it really sucks. So, yeah. Ugh. Oh. Okay. Everyone doesn't want to do with the the phantoms. Okay. I understand. <laughs> I don't want to either. But I mean, you don't have to sleep all the time. You got like 7 days before you die or something. <laughs> Anyways, um, so there's also another thing that I want to talk about while I'm walking south for the winter. This is a hole. Uh, so I bought some things on Wish. If y'all, I don't think I told, I haven't told y'all. This was before 1.13 hit and stuff like that. Okay, so I bought some things on Wish a couple of months ago. And it was like four things or so. Uh, I got steel soap. Uh, steel soap bar. So, when you... Basically, the steel soap helps get bad smells off your hand. Well, supposedly. I haven't had any bad smells on my hand yet to try it out. So, uh, when I get fish or something, that sort of bad smell on my hand. I'm going to be trying it out. But uh, anyways, am I still going south? Yes, good. So anyways, uh, I also got these face scrubbers. Um, these little squishy cat squid face scrubbers that were so cute. And uh, I didn't think that they could be any more crapper than they came. Um, basically, they they are like mass produced, and the people that make them they don't really care what they do with them. They don't even care how they they you know put the sponge in and stuff. The sponge doesn't fit the thing, and it's just wadded up in there. No matter how hard I tried to make it fit and to make it less squished ow, and things like that, it just made it worse. So, I am not buying anything else from Wish. Uh, I'm done. <laughs> I've learned my lesson and Wish is, is... Wish isn't a thing to get stuff from. Like... I mean, maybe it's some a few clothes, but nothing else. Like, hi, Mr. Zombie. How are you? Have an axe to your face. Thank you. Uh, like, maybe a few clothes and this and that, but not, like... <gasps> it's my first time seeing salmon! Look at them! Wow. This is great. 
Wow. Oh, I like salmon. They're so cute. They're even pretty delicious, too. But anyways, um, so, yeah, no more, no more buying on Wish. I'm done. <laughs> Uh, as, no matter how much cute things that they have, I'm, I'm just not doing it because it's just a bunch of ripoffs. Like, literally. Y you should totally buy from the stores that are around you locally. They're just not worth it. So. Um. I can't really think about anything else to talk about. Oh man, okay, um... What else is to talk about? Oh! Oh, oh, oh! So, my... A month or so ago, I decided to do a terrarium. That looks like Pride Rock, almost. Um, I decided to do pride, uh, not pride, wah, <laughs> dang it, um, so, I, I got a terrarium, I made a terrarium, didn't get a terrarium, nice, um, and it started out to be really awesome. I didn't think anything, you know, would go bad. And then, like, a plant died. And I was like, well, that's, that's common, you know? It was, it looked like it was going to die anyways. And then another plant just recently died. It was really thriving. And then all of a sudden it just, just went. And I thought that was really strange. So, this, this tank has been up for a month, two months now, and I only lost one plant in one month, month and a half, and then all of a sudden this recent month, this other plant was starting to die. So, I was like, okay, maybe it's time to do some more maintenance on this when, you know, you it doesn't really need a lot of maintenance, you just have to like watch it and keep it watered or some stuff. Uh, make sure it doesn't dry out, you know. So one day I actually did leave, uh, I left it for too long. And I think that well, it, it couldn't have dried out because the the soil was really moist. So I think is the other reason that I'm about to get to. Um, so as I was leaning on the table, staring into the the tank, and I was touching the dying plant, it was really squishy. Like, I've never felt a plant this squishy. Like, it just... If I had actually... Oh my god, I'm on the cliff side. Holy crap. Mm. Uh, if I had, like, pressed down fully, the leaves would have just deteriorated right there in my hand. And it was rotten. The plant was rotten. And I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't think... Like, plants got this rotten so quickly. I, I didn't. I didn't. I've, I've never seen a plant rot in a few, in just a few short days, like it had. So then I knew something was really wrong, and I was like, okay, maybe it's the soil. Maybe the something is really wrong with the soil. So... I am digging these these pl these little uh, plants up with a spoon, and all of a sudden, <laughs> oh my, freaking spiders shoot out everywhere! 
like I had broken open an egg sac that was laid underneath this plant. No, maybe not broken open. Maybe they were just like actually already hatched and they were I just disturbed them, but they mm -hmm. killed the plant. They they made it get destroyed. And I was like, "Oh my god." And so I just scooped the plants up and put them in a Tupperware box and threw them outside. No more no more spiders, but the mother was still in there and a few others. And so I'm like, "Oh my god." No, I'm not dealing with this. No, 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 no. So, after that, I began looking. I began looking into the reason why this terrarium was going downhill fast. And lo and behold, as I stood there staring with a bright light on the water channel that was straight down the middle, I saw these little white bugs hopping about in on the water, in the water and on the water. I think she's around me, maybe. <laughs> Is she around me? Well, anyways, I'm not even going to be living here either way. Um, so, I started screaming. I'm like, nope, nope, I'm done. I am done. This is not happening. Oh my god, no. And so, I, I was done. I had Mitch take the, the terrarium out and throw it out. That was last night. This morning I went out to go and and oh look at the fish, the cod and stuff. <gasps> oh look at him jump. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. So anyways, uh, I think she's over there now that I think about it. But, uh, anyways, uh, someone had taken out all of the plants, all of the rocks, now that I think about it, they took out all these big river stones. And they thought, they must have thought that the person that threw this out, this thing out, was an idiot, because this, these river stones really, co they cost a good bit. Um, originally we were using them for a, a fish tank, for an actual 50 gallon fish tank and um, the, we sold the fish tank and we just decided with sand instead so food kept going into the stones and getting caught and building stuff up and it wasn't good so we used sand um, so they took all the stones they took all the plants and they just left the the soil and the, the uh, mulch mulch bark, whatever it is. So. Oh, look at the turtle! <gasps> look at the turtle eggs! Oh, wait, no, those, those, are, those are just turtles. Um. Jesus Christ, bunny, hang on. Okay. So... That was weird, my boat just moved on its own. So anyways, um, it just, it wasn't good. <laughs> I'm so glad that she can have the, or whoever got the plants, that they can have these plants and care for them and tend to them uh, with the spiders. So enjoy the spiders, whoever got those plants. Uh, I'm happy that they have a new home. So, yeah. Oh, lordy. Okay, so I need a place down... This. And I need to... This. Um, I need to... That would be...
be wasteful. I don't want to do that. You know what? I don't really need a crafting table. <laughs> Why do I even have a crafting table? I don't even need the sticks, but I have sticks anyways. I'm making a lot of sense here. Okay. It'll just spawn. Alright. So, there are my stories. I hope that y'all have thoroughly enjoyed my stories because I this this happened like yeah this this just happened so mm. also I'm up to two videos at the moment having been recorded last night I was too late to post the first video and I'm on my second video. So the first video is going to go up today. The second video is going to go up tomorrow. Uh, and the third video is going to go up the day after. So I'm on the second day of Minecraft. For me. But it's actually Minecraft is on day 52 in the, in the world. <coughs> so. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. <gasps> Look at dolphins! Hi! Hi! Oh, y'all are so cute. Y'all are awesome. I wonder if we'll see ships. That would be awesome to see ships. Oh, man. I just hope I don't run across... Is that a mushroom island? It is a mushroom island. That's cool. Wait, no it's- yes? No it's not. It's not. It's just a thing. <laughs> okay, got it. Anyways, um, I'm glad 1.13 is here. I'm just thrilled. I'm happy that it's back. Uh, there's a ravine over there, and there's some dolphins. Something crazy. Like, legitly, my build is, is, is crazy. Like, no joke. It, it's nuts. I don't even think that I have words to describe this building style that I'm going to do be doing. Um, I, I don't, I'm just going to, you're just going to see me build it. That's, that's all I can say is, is watch me build this, this thing because that's, that is the only way you're going to be able to understand what exactly I'm doing and why I'm doing what I'm doing. So, <laughs> um, I'm, I'm gonna be building pretty far away because I need my own chunk of land for what I want to do. Um, and look at all the turtles. Oh, the turtles. So yeah, uh, this is this is what I'm gonna be doing. I'm going to be doing my own type of forest with houses in it, um, and I'm going to be lay overlaying the the forest, uh, just playing out with white diorite, uh, and the only things that are going to be used in this forest are um, you know all the different trees that I'm getting right now this is the only reason why I'm going around gathering all the trees that I possibly can is to make a huge forest with them and make my own type of thing like a tree and stuff so um, I have one, two, three, four out of the 
six trees. We have oak, we have birch, we have spruce, we have acacia, we need dark oak. We did have a piece of dark oak, but not, not, I don't need one piece, I need four. Uh, and I also need jungle. Jungle's another one. So, oh no! Rip. So I'm hoping that I can find I can find a little bit of jungle. But finding a jungle in this place now is hard as can be. So yeah. I'm never really good at finding jungles. I never, I've never been good at it, so. Alright, so I'm here in a taiga biome. I think it's a taiga. Is this a taiga? Tundra, taiga, biome. Mountains. Mountains, biome, okay. They have changed that face setting right there. It's crazy. Um... Is this a what? That's an oak tree, okay. Um So yeah. Um I am coming up with just a really strange building ideas as of late to to make me happy. Um I don't think that it'll bore me at all because sometimes when I build something I get bored of it and I don't want to repeat it and stuff like that but this this is something really interesting I've never had an idea quite like this before and it's it's rather it just intrigued me um, these woods, these forests, and things like that. Um, oh, log. What happened to your bed? Oh. Well, I always bring a bed with me when I cave now. <laughs> um, like you, 1.13 has made us realize what we can and cannot do anymore. Um, you, you can't go places without a bed, like at all. That's almost like sleeping on the ground or and just, you know, being, nocturnal for the rest of your life in Minecraft. Why is my, my boat not being able to... What? Oh! God, okay. Found it! <laughs> uh, that's almost like being noctur nocturnal. What the... That was weird. Uh, in Minecraft. And... Stuff like that. Um, am I going the right way again? South, yeah. So, it's... It's interesting. Um, you have to bring a boat when caving. You have to bring a boat when farming. <laughs> Uh, you had to bring a boat everywhere. Just everywhere. So. Yeah. Alright, anyways, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed. I'm gonna be walking for a bit more. Um. And. Uh, 
just sleeping and walking and things like that off camera. So, anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed my stories. I will try to have more. And... Uh, I will try to have more, but I can't guarantee it, you know. So, anyways. Um, but yeah, I will see y'all later. Until next time. Bless them. Bye, guys! <laughs>